Hello, and welcome to Vicon Valeris Tutorials. In this video, we'll show how to view and control live video feeds in the Valeris client. We'll also discuss the live preview features and functions in the monitoring screen. First, let's look at adding cameras to our viewing area. To do that, click and drag the camera that you would like to view to an empty tile. Remember that the layout of the display area can be changed using the button above it. This will start a live feed of the camera and will enable different controls for the tile. If you've created views for your system, you can drag and drop the entire view onto the screen in the same manner. You can do the same to start running a tour if you have created one. Note that a tour has special controls showing for the tab on top allowing to pause and restart it without stopping it. To make a tile switch to a large, single layout, simply double click anywhere on the tile. To return back to the previous state, double click anywhere again. You can see the control options for each camera by hovering over the options bar of each tile. Note, if you wish to keep the control button in place all of the time, you can pin them to place by clicking this icon. These options are dynamic and will change based on the type of camera and its capabilities. Museum Search. This is a shortcut to the Museum Search screen and will open with this camera already selected. Museum Search is available for Vicon cameras only. Thumbnail Search. This is a shortcut to the Thumbnail Search screen and will open with this camera already selected. Thumbnail search is available for all cameras on Valeris. Playback mode. Opens the playback bar at the bottom of the tile and lets you play back recorded video from the NVR. You can learn more about playback in our video clip about it. Digital zoom. We will discuss this later on in this video. Configure. This is a shortcut to the configuration page for the specific camera and will open in its video channel configuration screen. Export. We'll start the export process for the camera in the tile. You can learn more about the export process in our video clip about it. PTZ presets. For PTZ cameras, this button will be enabled allowing calling up presets if these were set in advance. 360 camera presets. For hemispheric cameras, this button will be enabled, allowing calling up presets if these were set in advance. 360 camera display views. For hemispheric cameras, this button will be enabled, allowing calling up predefined display views. Pressing the X button will stop the live stream from the camera. You can also stop all cameras in the tab by pressing the stop button at the top of the screen. Some of the shortcuts shown on the tile controls are also available by right clicking the resource in the resources list. Here, like on the tile, they will open based on the camera functionality. If you want to switch any tile to view a different camera, drag the new camera to the bar at the top of the specific tile. To switch between two running cameras tiles, Click and drag from one camera's option bar to another's and the two will switch places. Valeris offers you the option of digitally zooming into the video you are viewing, both for live and playback, without affecting the recording or anyone else viewing the camera. To use digital zoom, hover with your mouse over the options bar and click the digital zoom button. A small rectangle at the upper left of the tile will show the full camera view and the rest of the screen will show the zoomed area. To zoom, you can either select an area to zoom on by clicking and dragging your mouse or you can zoom toward the middle of the picture using the scroll wheel on your mouse. Let's say you see something suspicious on the table in the terminal. Click and select the area of the table and now you can see it's just a napkin. To zoom all the way out, you can either scroll out or click the scroll wheel on your mouse. You can also move the zoom area 
by clicking and moving the red box in the screen on the upper left of the tile. We hope this video helped you learn the basics of viewing live cameras. For more videos on more topics, go to our YouTube channel.